Hello, this is Cynthia from the Teaching Learning Center, and this is a quick video to show students how to submit assignments in case it's your first time, but also a little bit of a change that's occurred in how to view feedback from your instructor once they've graded your assignment. All right, so you access your assignments in your course. Um, generally, it could either be embedded within your weekly content or a specific assignment button. All right, so you just click the, the name of the assignment, which is a link. From here, you can see when the assignment is due as well as how many points are possible. You'll read the instruction as noted here. Um, and in this case, we're going to upload a document. All right, so you're just going to then click the Browse My Computer button, pass to your document. You can see the name of the document below once you've attached it. If you made a mistake and attached the wrong one, just click the Do Not Attach button. It asks you if you're sure you want to not attach that one, and then just start over, browse my computer, find your document, and attach that. Okay, you could add specific comments to your instructor if you have questions about the assignment, um, but that's optional. And then just click Submit. Once you do that, that goes to your instructor's grade center, um, and they can they will then provide feedback and grade it. And then you'll see whatever comments or your grade from my grades. All right, so let's see what that looks like. All right, so now that um, you've submitted your assignment, the instructor has graded it, let's see what you got for a grade as well as any feedback that was provided. Okay, so we'll click on the My Grades button. Look for the assignment and notice there's a speech bubble next to your grade. If you're new to my grades, you can see what your final grade was out of how many points possible. Okay, so in this case, you got full points. So clicking on this speech bubble um, will show you the overall feedback that the instructor has provided about your work. But there could also be specific feedback placed on your document itself. So let's look at that. So you just click the name of the assignment, which is a link which should open this um, submission history page with um, your document and any feedback. So the blue icons um, is what's new on the assignment and, and viewing your comments. Um, before, you might have seen speech bubbles on the right side that explained what the, any comments your instructor provided, but now you're just going to place your mouse over the icon and that will display the comments provided by your instructor. So they just provide comments next to a particular point in your document. So you make sure that you do place your mouse over every single icon that you see like that to get all the feedback. All right, if you have any questions, let your instructor know. Thank you.